I have this really cool piece. This was a prop in The Godfather. The movie? The movie, The Godfather. It is literally one of my favorite movies of all time. Unlike most people, I don't like the movie. Because when I saw the horse's head, I was horrified and stopped watching it. I have to say, the horse head in the bed thing is a real good way to get a deal done. I almost threw a horse's head in your bed when you wouldn't give me a percentage of the business. <laughs> I buy storage lockers at public auction. It was in one of the lockers that I purchased. I'm not a fan of the movie, but I know that there are a lot of fans of that movie. So I think I'll be able to do OK. It was one of the greatest dramas ever made. It really was. I mean, up until that point, movies weren't this dark, and the characters weren't this rich. It was number one in 1972. It was the number two or three movie of all time up until that point, how much it grossed. It is considered by everyone an absolute masterpiece. It was a career-building movie. I mean, Al Pacino, De Niro, I mean, there was just tons of actors in those movies that got their start and stayed famous for 30, 40 years because of it. I was right around 20 years old the first time I saw The Godfather. I was blown away. It's got everything. Great writing, great directing, great actors. What else do you need? Do you have paperwork on this stuff? I have a certificate of authenticity from the Ellis Prop Company that says it was sold at an auction they had in 1999. And I have a letter with a picture of the jewelry box also indicating that it was in the movie. This deco-style ballet jewelry box was issued to the set of The Godfather for use in background scenes. Now, do you know what scene it was in? No, I tried to figure it out, but I couldn't watch it. And it doesn't say anything in the paperwork, either. So you want me to make you an offer you can't refuse? Correct. And how much would you like me to buy it for? I saw other people selling props from The Godfather, and they were asking for about $1,000. If you ever go to a movie set, OK, especially big productions like The Godfather, mm -hmm. there's thousands and thousands of things on set. Now, if you were talking about the movie The Godfather, I'd want Dito Corleone's hat. The, the gun that was taped behind the toilet in the end of the movie. Uh, you got a $5 jewelry box. I mean, this is just such a small prop, and it's almost insignificant. This is the jewelry box sitting in the corner of the room that you got to see on set for maybe three seconds. I don't see this worth money. OK. I disagree. I think that there's a large fan base for The Godfather. I think that you'd be able to sell this for a good amount of money. Trust me, if I thought I could make money on this thing, I would snatch it right up from you. I don't think I can make any money on it, period. OK. Thanks for coming in, though. Thanks for your time. I appreciate it. Appreciate it. After they talked so much about the movie, I was really very surprised that they didn't make an offer. But I'm pretty positive I'll be able to sell it on my own. Wow. This thing is nice. This is a casting out. This is like one of the holy grails of American coins. I'll do 95, and that's it. No, I don't think so. I think I'm going to take it home.